All right, guys, I'm here at Pops Burger Stand in Waxahachie, Texas. And I got a special guest on today's episode. Yeah, and Billy's back there somewhere. Somewhere. <laughs> So I got a Pops burger, brought to you by Funko. <laughs> Basically your standard average cheeseburger. Angus beef patty, cheese, pickle, less tomato, hot toasted bun. I think you got the same thing. Did you got onion rings? I did get onion rings. I even went with the, with the Freedom Fries. Fries aren't too bad. There's a like little, uh, little like uh, unique spice to it, like bud spice type of thing. Could be a little bit more crispy. I right, my fries a little bit more. You know what I mean? Crunchier. I've always been a uh, fan of soft fries. Go ahead and taste the burger. Say like mush? It's not that good. Alright. Tastes like water burger. A little bit. Meat kind of has like a little aftertaste. Your turn, what'd you get? I just got a, I actually got the same thing he did. Uh, however, mine doesn't have all those uh, vegetables, those unneeded vegetables. It's just uh, pickles and onions, really all you need. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like the meat, No, not really. The, the, the meat, meat has a little like, it's like, weird. Yeah, like it hits your tongue, but it's not bad. Okay, so I went with the Pops Burger as well. As you can see, you got uh, pickles, onions, tomatoes. Um, the bun is toasted, which I like. Yeah. The meat hits you with like a little twang it's, after it's you. Um, Good. You guys said like like one burger. I think it's still better actually. You think, think it's better? better? I think it's better. Okay. Good. Definitely fresh. You can tell, which it should be. Let's try these onion rings. Mm. Hashtag never frozen. Got a got a light batter on them. As you can see. Yeah. Not cut super thick. I really like really thick onion rings. I like this. All right, so final thoughts, and let's grade this. I think personally, I liked it. It was Angus beef, it was fresh, not frozen. The onion rings were pretty good, lightly battered, not too much. Uh, the seasoning in the batter was pretty pretty all right too. Not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. 
Um, You're getting very thorough with it. I was just gonna say, yeah, I love the anus beef, beef, and uh, I like the uh, the fries were good. Uh, and uh, I drank soda for the first time in a while too. <laughs> I had uh, some cherry Pepsi. Cherry Pepsi. You know what? Amazing. Cherry Pepsi is good. So I'm good. not a Pepsi what is, guy. What's your score? Oh God. Uh, Eight out of ten. I mean, it didn't blow me away, but it was good. Yeah, like, I wouldn't be like, oh, man, we got to fucking come here and eat, but... I mean, if we're in town, I would definitely I, come I back. like the ambience, yeah. you know, the little Coke. Sign. What's funny is it's Coke on the outside, but it's Pepsi on the inside. You're not wrong. So that's false advertising, so you I got to knock, knock them down a peg right there. I'd say a good 7.5. Uh, I'm not a fan of the Angus taste on beef. I like, I like the, like, I guess the... The fake regular beef. You know what I mean? I like a little bit more of a charboiled taste. Fair. Uh, I like a little bit more of like uh, like the fries, a little bit more crispy, but it was good. Wasn't too bad. I probably would have liked to try a milkshake. Places like these have good milkshakes. Well, we should have tried a milkshake then. I mean, fail on our end. I'm going to give this place a good solid 8 of 10. 7.5. 8 of 10. So we got an average score of what, like 7.85 or something. Not bad. So if you were. I would prefer a Diet Coke, though, not a fucking Diet Coke. Well, that's on you, though. So, but, um, yeah, so if you're in Waxatchee Pops Burger Stand, check it out.